Mama don't allow no architecture around here. Mama don't allow no architecture around here. Oh, I don't care what Mama don't allow, gonna draw my modern anyhow. Mama don't allow no architecture around here. Hi, this is George Smart, and you've probably been waiting a while for U.S. Martinist Radio to come back on your iTunes or on some other technical device that you have. And it's because we've been away for a while. We've been retooling and having fun doing things like that. Frank, uh, what's been going on with you this last year? Well, you know, I'm in a bar in Shanghai. Uh, I'm, I'm working a cruise, and I... <laughs> I, I think somebody slipped something into a beverage. Uh, I woke up on a tramp steamer, and I've been sailing the world delivering cotton for the last year. I was able to jump ship in San Diego. It's for sure I've got friends there, and they took me in and hid me. So that the, uh, so it's nice to be back. Frank, it was so nice of you to call <laughs> and check in from the tramp steamer. <laughs> And isn't it great that the tramp steamer has high quality Wi-Fi, Frank? I think that's I'm, excellent. I'm a little I mean, suspicious. Yeah, yeah, because the cruise ships, you know, the the Wi-Fi on the cruise ships, which they charge for by the minute, is slower than old people make love. <laughs> <laughs> and Tom, you've been traveling too. Uh, yes, uh, George. I've been uh, actually. I went around the world last year. We uh, we went to Paris and Bangkok and San Francisco because my girlfriend's got a son who's working in Thailand teaching English, and she wanted to go visit him. And I said, "Well, not without me, you won't." So I had a great year. Well, I bet you did, Tom, because Tom took all the money we paid him for last season and oh. went around the world with it. Oh, you weren't supposed so. to notice that. <laughs> I love, you know, you got to do it first class, you know. Exactly. So we have some great things coming up this year on U.S. Modernist Radio. Our next show, which is going to premiere on Monday, March the 6th, Chris Madrid French and Adele Seigelman are going to be talking about modernist evil lairs, places <laughs> like Alfred Hitchcock's house in North by Northwest that was by Mount Rushmore. You may remember that. And also yeah. the house uh, in Diamonds Are Forever, where Sean Connery uh, meets the um, evil ruler who's got this real cool house. These evil lairs tend to be modernist, and we're going to talk with two experts in that field about how this comes about and where some of these lairs are around the world. And why do evil people wind up getting the best houses? I know. I guess they just don't like the colonial revival style. <laughs> 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 Sorry, but that's funny. <laughs> then coming up on Monday, March 20th, we have a great show with Jan Richard Kiekert and Paul Moore. These are two gentlemen that have been tracking modernist houses in different ways all around the globe. We'll have a great time hearing about how they research these houses and in Jan Richard's case, how he and his friend Tico actually came to America from the Netherlands and started exploring John Lautner houses one after the other after the other over a series of months through most of the LA and Palm Springs area. I'm also going to be out live in Palm Springs for Modernism Week, talking with some of the main speakers from that great conference. We'll be talking to Janice Lyle with Sunnylands, Todd Ziegler with Indiana Landmarks, Bert Simonis, who's produced a great documentary on Hugh Kapter, uh, Penelope Seidler, who is the wife of Harry Seidler and Daryl Delora, producer of a new documentary. We'll be talking with Brooke Hodge from the Palm Springs Museum of Art and my good friend, Ms. Modernism herself, Annalisa Capiro, will be coming on the show. Oh, she's fun. She is great. She's really wonderful. Also a new feature this year is our new head of research, Rebecca Laney, who will be coming and telling us things from time to time about information that we didn't think we needed to know. And we want you to tune in again, starting every two weeks on Monday, March the 6th. <laughs>